Fellas, as soon as she says this one thing to you, cut her off ASAP. Salute to the MABW team. I'm back with another video. Fellas out there, listen up, man. I know you have your own pet peeves about some women out there. I know that some of you men already have your own red flags that you see in women. That'll make you leave them ASAP. But one thing I want to tell you for sure. If any lady at all, whether you're dating her or she's your girlfriend already, if she ever says this to you, drop everything with her and leave her alone ASAP. And I'm going to explain to you why. If a lady that you're dating or you're with ever in her life comes out her mouth and tells you that you're not a real man because you're not doing this, you need to leave her alone ASAP. Why do you say that, MABW? How can she define what a real man is? And I tell the men out there all the time, women play these games. If you don't let them move in with you, if you can't buy them a certain item that they need, if you can't take care of their bills, they want to try they want to try to classify you as not being a real man. But my 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 message to the ladies out there, if you're classifying your boyfriend or your husband as not being a real man, how come you're not with that real man that you're pretty much trying to identify that your husband is not? So all the men that you've dealt with, this is for the ladies out there. All of the men that you have dated, they're not real men. Because if you dated that real man, why aren't you with that real man? That's why I feel like women can't say that. They can't say that at all. How can they define what a real man is with that they're dating when they're not with a real man? If these women can try to shame you and tell you that you're not a real man, why aren't they with a real man? So you telling me these ladies are in their 30s, 40s, 50s, and they're trying to tell you as a man that you're not a real man? How can they classify you as not being a real man? Guys, once any lady tells you that, that you're dating or you're with, that means that she's ready to move on. Or she has found somebody else or she's dealing with somebody else that's basically showing her what she at least thinks a real man is. Some of you men out there, some of my brothers out there, you don't catch on to the little hints that ladies throw at you or the little bit of shade that they throw at you. They say certain stuff purposely to get up under your skin. And one of the biggest things that's a pet peeve of mine or that no woman should say to any men at all is that you're not a real man. And they always use that term against men when men can't do for them. All the time. These women come into your life and they feel like if you don't choose a certain time or a point in time in your life to marry me by, you're not a real man. Why do men have to orbit or make sure every outcome in life is based around women? Guys, women, literally, some of them, they want you to orbit around them. Everything that you do and the way that you move in life, they want you to move like that based off of them. When are we going to move in together, babe? I'm not ready to move in. I'm not ready to, uh, you know, live with anybody yet. You're not a real man. Real men moving with their girlfriends. To my men out there. Is basing yourself as a real man moving in with your girlfriend or letting your girlfriend move in with you into your household? Is that what becoming a real man is? Because if you think that's what a real man is, you need not to be on this channel and you need to unsubscribe ASAP. Because that's not what being a real man is. And I don't want to sit up here and give you false hope. See, that's the thing about your boy MABW. I'm not going to sit up here and pander. I'm not going to sit up here and pander. And my audience that have been rocking with me since 2021, they know that your boy MABW is not going to sit up here and pander. 
to anybody in my audience, any of the ladies out here, I'm not doing it. I got to keep it real with you. I got to keep it all the way real with you. To the men out there, do you think being a real man is marrying your lady? Would marrying your girlfriend classify you as a real man? Because these women out here, they actually believe if you don't marry them, then you're not a real man. See, this is one thing that the fellas out there need to notice. Everything that she wants to try to class, she everything that she says to you as far as not being a real man, she's just saying it because her saying that to you only benefits her. It only benefits her. If you marry her, just because she classified you as not being a real man, if you don't marry her, who will it benefit in the end? You got to think about that. Who does marriage benefit? Does it benefit you or does it benefit her? It benefits her. So don't let her shame you into believing that you're not a real man if you don't pop the big question to her. If you don't get on one knee and propose to her. You're still a real man. You were brought onto this earth as a man. Nobody can classify what a real man is. You know what you are deep down inside. You know the weight that you hold and the power that you hold deep down inside. No woman, no woman out there has a right to classify you as not being a real man. And that's only a shaming tactic that most women out here use. It's the biggest shaming tactic of modern society, especially coming from Western women. They love throwing that term out to men. And I don't see why men put up with it. Soon as she says that, if you're, living, if you're living with her, pick up your stuff and leave. If she's living with you, pick up her stuff and put it by the door and tell her goodbye. Tell her goodbye. You're not going to tell me if I'm a real man or not. You're a woman. You stay in a woman's place. Just like as a man, I'll stay in a man's place. I'll stay in a man's place. I can't tell women out there what a real woman is, but I can't state what I don't like about what some women do. But I can't tell women, you're not a real woman if you don't do this. You're not a real woman if you don't do this. I can't say that, and I won't say that. But I will tell you what I dislike about you and how I believe you should act as an adult. That's what your boy MABW will say. That's what I say to all the women out there. Because there's just certain things you shouldn't do once you reach a certain age. Once you reach a certain age, it's time to grow up. It's time to stop twerking. It's time to stop going on social media, being half naked. It's time to stop classify, classifying yourself as a real lady when it comes to body-wise when you got fake body parts. That's what I will say if I say you women aren't real as well. You can't call yourself a real lady if you got a busted lace front in your head, makeup all over your face, a BBL, fake breast. You can't classify yourself as a real lady if you got those things going on with yourself. Other than that, I have nothing else to say about you being a real lady or not. But to my brothers out there, my black brothers, my white brothers, my Latino brothers, my Asian brothers, males from all over. If a lady ever tries to classify you as not being a real man because you're not doing something for her, kick her out the door and tell her bye-bye. Anyways, that's my video for today. If you like the video, of course, comment, like, and subscribe. It ain't costing you a damn thing. And of course, I'ma holla back at y'all later. Peace.